So I can't really see if the new one's working. That's just the way it is in this brave new world. <laughs> it's like things fix themselves magically. I mean, I'm a computer programmer. I worked. I had a couple apps. Uh, I used to sell. I have a couple hundred users around the world, but uh, this, this is way out of my thing. I saw for about five years and uh, wrote books and when I came back, artificial intelligence had taken over the world. It's like things get decided by me machines and fixed by machines and things are kind of magic now it's like everything's out of my control that's for sure so today's blog is supposed to be about idealism the first thing i found was some really cheap solar prices so Mexico has announced its latest tender for three terawatt hours of solar. Let's see, a terawatt is a thousand gigawatts. That's a lot, like we talk about, like the big side sea dam here in BC is six gigawatts. So we're talking big here, 3,000 gigawatts at a price of 1.77 cents a kilowatt hour. U.S. 17.70 megawatt. I mean, that's really super cheap. I think this is a tender for the future, like 2020-ish, but it shows that people are serious about these numbers. Um, the offer beats the previous record of US 1.79 cents in Saudi Arabia, although the is yet to be confirmed, and a bid of US 2.1 cents kilowatt hour and a recent auction in Chile with the winning bid from NL. And now it's uh, their time that the story. So I just want to look at that page again because it you know talks about the individual bidders like NL1, but there was a company called Canadian Solar. I read an article on them. The kind of got, renegade guy from Ontario Hydro started up. I mean, we don't have any tariffs here in BC or Canada. Like down in the States, you have to deal with Donald Trump. 
is and his tariff, but we don't have that. In Canada, I mean, we, I thought it was too cold, but it doesn't matter if it's cold. It doesn't matter if it's sunny enough. And we have enough sunlight. There's a lot of sun around. So probably we should be doing the solar NBC here. So here's that list of bidders. You can see the NG. I don't know who that is. But their price of wind is right compared with their price of solar. I wonder what that means. It's quite good news though. Because they're both clean. And then NL, the other guys who won. The bid is 0 0.0177. Not $17 a kilowatt. <laughs> That's the going low price. And then you see down further, it's there's Canadian Solar's bid, 0 0.02. That's, like, what's that? Two dollars a megawatt? I don't know, but it's a very low number, I'm sure. It's quite impressive, this. Yeah, but...